Okay, so the latest update for GTA 5 on the PC has blocked the original script hook um, plugin. However, a little over 24 hours later, um, Alexander Blade, who is the developer of this script plugin, uh, has released an updated version of his mod or his plugin to work with the obviously updated version of GTA. So, very simple to install, but I'm just going to go through it because um, you need to make sure you've well, remove the other files properly you haven't uh, got some files left in there that we don't need so just quickly download link in the description it'll take you to uh, either GTA 5 mods um, there's a download button here which will take you to the uh, script hook page uh, his website devc.com and you can click the download button here okay so once you've downloaded that it'll be on your desktop as a sorry th these aren't the ones I want It'll be on your desktop as a .zip. It should be 1.0.350.2a. Extract that to your desktop. Simple enough. Go ahead and go to the uh, area where your Grand Theft Auto is installed. So for me, it's local disk C, program files, Rockstar Games, Grand Theft Auto 5. And in here, you can see what we put in for the original uh, GTA 5 script hook. We have the native trainer, um, script hook v.dll and somewhere there should be a dsound file yeah dsound.dll so if we open up the script hook folder and go into the bin folder we've got three files in here these two are going to replace the ones that we have already have in the folder so I'm going to go ahead and copy them and just paste these in and it's going to ask us to uh, copy and replace do it for both of these okay. so once they're in they'll have replaced the original ones and then we need to delete dsound.dll delete that out, we don't need that anymore back into the folder where the script hook plugin is and we've got these, uh, this new folder called uh, sorry this new file called dinput8.dll simple enough as we've done before you probably guessed already copy and paste it into our area and that way next time you boot up GTA this will um, allow the trainer to work again as a rule of one as a bit of a warning please either leave it to single player and you know if you're that cautious disconnect from the internet but do not use this online there has been some bans uh, for people who have been using mods either online or on single player as well uh, such as the FOV mod which obviously if you haven't got it installed it's still a similar um, way that these other mods work via the script plugin so just be careful make sure you either well like I said disconnect from, it, from the internet on your computer um, and just don't use them online don't be a dick don't use them online so thanks for watching um, and I'll try and keep up to date with the mods and the scripts as we go along with GTA 5